So my Steam library is just absolutely full of just random games. So I'm just going to go over some like different games that I have. So starting off, I got Monster Trucks Nitro here. Okay. It's been a long time since I played this game. This is a really old game. <clears throat> I think I first started playing this like uh, you piece of junk. So I first started playing this game way back when I was probably like in junior high. What the heck? Stupid logs. Get out of my way. Oh, oh, that's not fair. Okay. But yeah, anyway, so I first started playing this game like just long time ago. So, yeah. What? I gotta climb over this wall, I guess? What in the heck? This level's called Woods. <coughs> so, I don't know if... It's not actually in the woods, it's just there's tons of wood. Why is this thing stuck? my car. What the heck? It's an odd game. But anyway, this is made by the same people that made like Trials and whatnot. Huh, okay. So anyway, I'm going to try another level here real quick. Puddle Sprint. Alright. Man, those are some messed up shadows. I'm hoping my mic works good enough to hear this, because lately my, uh, I don't know what it is, but my mic's either, like, super loud or, like, not loud enough. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Alright. Backflip. Well, hey, no. I guess I overshot that one. Oh, come on. Man. You just go rolling in this game. Oh, that flickering is awful. <laughs> Alright. Level failed. Ah, oh, whatever. I don't care. There's so many of these levels, though. But yeah, this was a really funny game. Or a real fun game. Back when I was a kid. I loved playing this game. It's easily one of my favorites. So, if you've never played this, and you just kind of have, like, a laptop or something that's, like, not too good with games, then I recommend this, because... Like, it's probably the equivalent of, like, something you'd see, like, on a Flash website. Like, it's not too tricky. Oh my gosh, those shadows look terrible. There's so much stuff on this game that just looks like garbage. Huh. <laughs> well. I have the gr settings all the way up, too. That's what's funny. Front flip. Yeah! What? Man, I suck at this game. Alright, one more level. Then I'm gonna go to a different game. Alright, got some taxis up here. I don't even know. Someone will have to, like, look it up and tell me if miniclip.com is even a thing anymore. I have not heard of it. Huh. Dang, I just cleared that. What the heck? I would love to be able to make levels for this. That'd just be so fun. Oh, I 
actually beat it that time. But anyway, there's that game, Monster Trucks Nitro. Alright, here's another game, Hero Academy. Jeez, the volume on that is so loud. Huh. <clears throat> it doesn't look like I can actually change um, how loud the sound is. So I guess I'll just turn it off. Um, really? This game's only online? I guess I'll do challenges. Meet the council. Night fight. Knock out all the enemy heroes to win. So basically, this game is just a turn based kind of like chess kind of game. And it's uh, rather interesting. What is that? A trap? I don't even know. Huh. Dang. Obviously this would be more interesting with sound. But yeah, so... It's just some kind of weird... What the... Okay, so I failed that. My guess is... I get on this side... Actually... I'm guessing I get over here, hit this guy over here, move this guy to here, up his attack, hit these guys. What? Huh. It's kind of tricky. Hit that guy, I guess. This doesn't really make any sense. I'll hit this guy. 240 damage. Whatever. This doesn't make any sense. I'll try this thing. Warrior bash. Like, what is this? Oh, you just click it in and it tells you. Huh. I guess I should have hit this guy first and then guess I'll hit these two guys okay so this guy I hit first I don't know what that means I'll drop a fire on here hit this guy and that guy Anyway, this game's kind of stupid, but anyway, so I have so many games on Steam, I just kind of wanted to go over them. This is a different, just different thing to do. Um, so yeah, this, this is called Hero Academy, and it's kind of dumb because you can't really play a full game of it unless you're playing online, and this game's so old that I doubt it even has online anymore. Alright, so this game is called Frozen Synapse. I got this because it was on sale, super cheap. I think I paid like a dollar for it. Um. Okay. What the heck? Alright. So, it looks like... Oh. Okay, so this is some kind of like weird turn-based shooter thing. What the heck? Not even a shooter, just like some weird turn-based RPG looking 2D ghetto thing. What? What did he do? Went here. I don't get it. What? doesn't make any sense so I'm gonna bring this guy here and this guy here and engage this guy I guess I'll bring him here alright 
Oh my god. What? How do I get that guy to even fight that guy? Gauge on sight, you moron. Okay, let's see. What? I don't... Apparently his range isn't that far. So this game is pretty stupid, too. Like... It's just super ghetto, doesn't really have full screen, and it's just this weird, like, point and click kind of thing where you've. It's like not even like. Like, you have turns, too. Like, it's like literally like one of the slowest games. But, you know, it's pretty cheap because nobody likes it, and. You know, it doesn't look like it requires much to run, so if you ever want to play it, just, uh. Go out and buy it. So this game is called Mad Riders, and out of my list of just kind of random games, this is probably my favorite one. I don't know what this even has to do with anything. Lava worm? Okay. But yeah, this is... get this off my screen. So this is easily one of my favorite games. There's not much to it, but, you know, sometimes the simple games are the best. What the heck? This kind of reminds me of like an old style like arcade game, like one that you'd see at like a movie theaters or something. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? As you can tell, I haven't played this much. Or, I have, but I haven't played this in a while. But yeah, this game's really fun. Wow, it didn't take long to get up to third. Man, I completely missed those. What the heck? supposed to be a way to jump off these cliffs better. Oh, here we go. Alright. Now I'm really racing. This game has, like, good graphics. Uh, it kind of came out a while ago. It's made by Ubisoft, which I'm surprised they don't make you use uh, UB Play to actually play it. Holy cow. Dang. But yeah, this game is... Like... I'm surprised this game didn't like catch on more than it did. Because it's actually really fun. Alright. Oh no! Oh, okay. And then you just kind of get things... Yeah! So, originally, when uh, I played this game, I didn't know much about it, but you actually, you get different things for um, doing certain things. Like, so if you do, like, a backflip, front flip, whatever, then you get, like, extra uh, boost, and then you just try to be as fast as you can. But yeah, anyway, so there's that game. So that pretty much sums up the games I'm doing for right now, but, yeah, um, I have 123 games, and so, actually, here's, like, a more detailed list, but, yeah, so I just want to kind of get through some of these games, kind of, I'm not going to play them for very long, like, maybe not give them as much of a chance as I could, but just kind of talk about them a little bit and, like, what do I th think about them. This Battleborn is one of the ones I'm interested in trying, but I haven't yet. But anyway, thanks for watching my video, and subscribe if you liked it. I'm hoping to make a lot more content, and yeah, thank you.